Hi everyone. This video is part two in a series on Vortex Math. So if you haven't seen part one, I suggest you go watch it as each video in this series builds on what comes before it. Part two, IXXI. In 2020, I made a video explaining some aspects of IXXI. Everything is in IXXI. IXXI can be translated by Roman numerals, I being one, x being 10. Therefore, ix is 9 and xi is 11. So ixxi is 911. The number for emergency in North America is 911. In the UK, it's 999. Neither one is by mistake or coincidence. 911 is emerge and see. I made a video on this also. We live in a trauma center, also called a purgatory dumping ground by Devin Maggi in which major trauma induces a strong reaction from the chakra points provoking you to heal. Each chakra represents a different trauma center ruled by a planet. The alchemical process is about turning your lead into gold. It's healing your chakras, your trauma centers, by collapsing the rainbow bridge and returning to heart center, going green. I covered this in my Venus worship video. The process of turning lead into gold is about ascension, leaving the physical behind, the false ego, and rising into your authenticity, your AU, your gold, crown, corona, the sun. When you join heart, four, D with G, mind, seven, you join G and D and become like God. You emerge and see. You see through the veil. You speak the truth from the heart. You are crowned, anointed. You are a pharaoh. Please see my video on Phoenix for more information on this. 9-11. The words themselves reveal codes. 9 has 11 lines in the letters. So 9-11 is embedded in 9 itself. The 90s rock band Nine Inch Nails is coded with 911. The symbol for inch is two parallel lines, so nine inches is 911. Nails is an anagram for snail, which represents the Fibonacci sequence of all creation. Nail is also Vav in Hebrew, which means connect heaven and earth. In numerology, V is 22, A is 1, so Vav is 22 plus 1 plus 22, which is 4 plus 1 plus 4 equals 9. Vav is the vagina, the passageway into the material or earth from heaven. It is also the vesica Pisces. Jesus was nailed to the cross, the tree, the torus. Jesus is you, born into the torus. The uterus is the you, torus. VAV, pictographically, is Y, the flux capacitor. The flux capacitor shows the trinity, RGB, positive, negative, and neutral. Proton, electron, neutron, mother, father, and child. As we've already established, 9 is equal to 0. Therefore, 9 equals none. Vowels are interchangeable. Letters themselves have meaning. They are symbols and living entities, just like numbers. They emit a frequency. N means negation. O represents source or wholeness. I represents the self. E represents energy. Therefore, none is not one. One is not zero or source. It represents matter. N and N is a double negative. It cancels each other out. Nine is the reflection of source, which is self. Zero is nine. Within the words nine and none, is in and on. Therefore, in is equal to on. As within, so without. Nine is self, zero is source. What is in the self is reflected outside of the self, on source, on the screen. Eleven can also be broken out into L even. L is nine or zero. Even is equal or parallel or duality. L is God, and this shows the balance we need to achieve to rise or return home. So within eleven is nine eleven. 11 is also E, leaven. E is energy, and leaven is what we came here to do. The leavening is the process we are going through right now. It is to excite into fermentation, to rise, to return to our true nature. 1111 is Remembrance Day. Remember, remember the 11th of November. We came here first to forget, then to remember who we really are. 911, November is the 11th month. Nove means nine. So 11 is equal to 9. Nove backwards is Yvonne or 
even, which is 11. 11 represents two, or duality. Nine represents completion, or consciousness, zero, wholeness. 911 or 011 represents the Trinity. The character on Stranger Things, her name is Eleven. It is written 011. IXXI is an inverted mirror of itself. The material world is inverted. This image also reveals that there is a hidden mirror at its center that causes the image to invert. And this flips 9 to 11. So the IX is inverted to become XI. Therefore, 11 is 9 inverted. The material, or 11, is the inversion of 9, consciousness, our true state of wholeness. IXXI in numerology is broken into I equals 9 and X equals 24, which is 6. 2 plus 4 is 6. IXXI is then also 69, which is the yin yang. This also shows inversion. The equal sign is equals or level, and level can also be broken into L, Eve, L. Certain letters are interchangeable, just like vowels are interchangeable. So V and W are interchangeable. Eve is also U, E W E, which sounds like U, Y O U, and is also I, E Y E. So Eve is I is U. Again, level shows you that you are stuck between two pillars, or you are Jesus nailed to the cross of duality. The XX within the IXXI is the cube, the cross, the diamond pattern. The jewel of creation shows the cube. The XX is the sex hex, as above, so below. XX, the Freemasons, square or the male and compass female of duality or polarity of the material it is also the star of david the name david itself reveals the name eve a v i e v e which is revealed between the two d's d is delta the triangle the triangle the star of david the male and the female merged the eve is in the center of the cube the Star of David itself represents the cube. Delta is the door, the portal to the heart through meditation, the key to connecting heart with mind. Uniting the opposites is represented in the Star of David, uniting heaven and earth as above, so below, becoming aware of how thoughts become things, how we manifest on earth, and being mindful by connecting heart and speaking the truth, the way, the path to authenticity. David again is showing you that you are on the cross. You are in the cube. You are Christ consciousness trapped in the cube. You are in the DD, the triangle, the divide. The EVE is the IVI. For more information, see my video on individual. Much of what mainstream media would have you believe is that IXXI is satanic or evil. It is not. Kabbalah is Kaba Allah is God in the cube, you on the cross. There are infinite ways to examine IXXI, and this video is intended to be a means to provoke further insights. We have been discussing this topic in my Discord group. If you would like to comment or add to the discussion, please join us in the workshop section. We look forward to hearing your contributions, and stay tuned for part three.